Hello, my name is Radmila Popovic. I'm a senior education specialist working for Word Learning in Washington, D.C. I was the lead designer for this course. On behalf of the Word Learning team, I would like to welcome you to Teaching Grammar Communicatively, standalone Massive Open Online Course, or MOOC. I would also like to thank you for signing up for what I hope will be an engaging and challenging professional learning experience. In the weeks to come, you will explore what teaching grammar communicatively involves and what approaches and techniques can work for you and your students. We're not going to give you a recipe or a magic formula simply because such a thing does not exist. Teaching is a very complex job and for this reason, there are no simple solutions. What we are going to do in this course is to look at research-based evidence and also incorporate what has been discovered in reflective teaching practice to try to figure out what you can do at this point in your career to help your students improve their accuracy and fluency. We will learn from many experts in the field, both scholars and practitioners. We will share efficient, efficient practices, not best practices, and together we will explore what you can do to incorporate some of these ideas into your daily teaching so that your students improve their learning. This is a self-paced MOOC, which means that you can go through the materials at your own pace and take as much time as you need on each module. Please keep in mind that all assignments have to be completed before the course closure date. Each module has an order of tasks that you need to follow in order to advance in the course. First you do task one, then task two, etc. Which means that you can't first do task 10 and then go back to task one. You need to do each one in order. But once you complete a task, you can always go back to that page during the MOOC. Before you start working on module one tasks, please check the syllabus section. It contains a PDF syllabus document, which you can download, and I strongly recommend you do it straight away. Uh, the syllabus document contains the list of topics that will be covered in this course, as well as detailed information on how you will be assessed. I hope you will enjoy the course and that you will benefit from it both professionally and personally.